ahead. Portable cover of cat design. Didn't bother to take it with them. Looks like a war zone. According to survivors. From all sides. It was a massacre. You'd think there'd be more bodies. Not that I'm complaining. Not a lot left behind for a massacre. What if they were removed? We know the Nexus didn't bother picking up the bodies. You don't think it could have been the cat? That's a bad thought. Surprised the Nexus still wants an outpost on Eos. You know what they say, third time's a charm. We'll make this right. levels increasing. Radiation levels within a... I heard the attack on resilience was bad, but damn. Initiative's not military. They weren't prepared for an ambush. Figure that out. levels have spiked, Pathfinder. Schematics for Special Project Sigma. They were building something, but there are parts missing. This must be the project they were salvaging at Site 1. A way to fight the cat. We could finish it. All components at Site 2 had security tags, compiling possible nav points. Got a component for Site 2's project. Radiation levels increasing. What's up? You keep sighing. Do I? Sorry. Sid called and asked if I can get her a timer, metagel, and 15 pairs of socks. That can't be good.
crash shuttle ahead. One of ours. I'd know them anywhere. Worth checking, if only to make sure the cat don't get to keep it. Parts for the Site 2 project. Check. Activated. Deploying forward station. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. That looks like a cat facility of some kind. We saw them researching this tech back on Habitat 7. Doubt that's a coincidence. But if we want to look, the only way is through. This is where Chief Reynolds died. Sandstorms would have buried the body long ago. I suggest scanning. Karkins. Pathfinder, there is an armor piece buried deep. A leg bracer. Scan indicates tissue and bone fragments clinging to it. DNA identified as Chief Reynolds. Indications suggest his body was torn to pieces. So the Chief became Karkin food. Circle of life can be gruesome. The remaining armor will be scattered, or perhaps brought to a nest. The chest piece and his Omni tool may explain his death. Can we keep searching and scanning? Another armor piece. Chief Reynolds' helmet. The search continues. Nice dodge back there, Vetra. Very fancy. Thanks. Learned it from a pirate back in the Verge. Did you know him long? About a minute and a half. It wasn't much of a bar brawl. Pathfinder. The scanners picked up Chief Reynolds' chest piece. Confirming single shot. Unable to determine weapon type, but entry point was at the back. Exit blast through the chest. By all accounts, Nilkin was in front of the Chief when he fired. So it wasn't his shot that killed him. The Chief's Omni tool might shed some light. Picking up additional armor scraps. I believe it's a trail leading to a cave nearby. Could be where the nest is located. Parking nest, all right. Fan out. Hostiles ahead! Confirming initiative equipment, including Omni tool assigned to Security Chief Hiram Reynolds. If you power it up, I can exhume its data. Accessing data. The Chief was scanning at the time of death. The scan picked up two shots. One, a standard initiative rifle report, which missed. The other from behind, a Ket pulse weapon. This proves Milken is innocent. He didn't shoot Reynolds. Seems clear to me. Good work. Pathfinder, there is also an audio recording. Go ahead and play it. No! Where's Nilkin? Sorry, old friend. Had to do it. I'm not dying on this rock. That sounds like... Confirming. Voice identified as suspect, Nilkin. So he did not kill the chief. But he meant to. Need another chat with the man.
In all your time with the Asari, did you ever meet an Ardat Yakshi? Not that I know of. Always wondered about our sniper, Tethys, though. Radiation within safe levels. Life support is stable. I'm picking up initiative tech nearby from above us. There, look, up near that scaffolding. I'll be able to interface Pathfinder. Uh. Building connection. I apologize for any discomfort. The system seems unstable. This would happen when my dad tried doing this? Your father interfaced directly with the atmosphere processor. That proved extremely hazardous. These structures could reveal its control center. System remains unstable. Doubling our power input might accelerate the process. I'll give it a shot. Studying this tech for months. I don't know how you activated those glyphs, but you have to let them cycle through their channels. It's going to be all right. Trust me, okay? I know, I know. Who am I? I mean, it's obvious who you are. I saw the ship swoop in. You're a pathfinder. I was beginning to think the initiative just made you guys up so the rest of us wouldn't lose hope, but you're for real, huh? Are you for real? You were going to tell me who you are. I might just be the solution to all your problems. Well, look at that. System has stabilized. I'm establishing a connection. Oh, crap. I know these things! From Habitat 7! Later! Just take them out! Keep targeting that one! They make a little bot!
first tangle with the Remnant was a lot messier. The Remnant? These monoliths, the Observer and Assembler bots, they're all the remnants of something much bigger. But that's too long. Ugh, I hate long. So, the Remnant. Like, my name's better as PB. Ryder, you've been studying this Remnant technology? What have you learned? Plenty. Not nearly enough. It's old, it uses glyphs, and it's well protected. I saw this tech clear the skies on Habitat 7. We're hoping it could do the same for EOS. Huh. Atmosphere manipulation? Maybe. Fits the model. All Remnant tech is connected. You interfaced with this monolith somehow, and now it's pinging the others. If you wake them up too, they must lead to whatever master switch might fix the radiation. Interface with the monoliths, follow the connection to the source. Easy enough. Sure. Just don't piss off too many observers. Here, take my nav points. I'll be... I've got to figure this interfacing out. Just be careful. This planet's all kinds of strange. Fascinating, huh? Oh, this is the kind of stuff that gets you out of bed in the morning, too. Solving alien mysteries on hostile worlds, do you need to ask? <laughs> A woman after my own heart. Follow my nav points, figure out those monoliths, and we can both get some answers. We're hoping this tech can fix the atmosphere and make EOS livable. Think it's possible? Yes! Maybe. Possibly? This tech is so new. I mean, old here, but new to us? Who knows what it can do? How old is it exactly? It's been dormant for centuries, which I guess isn't actually that old. Huh. But long enough for conditions here to get royally screwed up, if they really are connected. Is anyone else camped out on Eos? There's the Ket, Clancy Salvagers, one angry old man. Who do you mean? Let's just say he's here to squish Ket, and doesn't care whose gear he tramples. How did you get here? After what happened with the outposts, I didn't expect to run into anyone. I had a ride. I had to fudge the flight plan a little. The Nexus didn't want to risk anyone else. Or let people see how rough it got. Sad. But there's still so much here. And some of us want to find it. We didn't come all this way to sit on our hands. The bots were saying, you had names for them? I had to call them something. The observers fly around spying on anyone who touches this tech. The assembler ones make other remnant. Not sure how yet. Maybe manufacturing or 3D printing. And breachers smash into anything they don't like. Which is us. Easy to remember. Is PB a typical Asari name? Never heard it in my Huntress days. Oh, you know things? Good for you. I know other things. It's a name. Good enough and short enough. For now. Well, I'll head out. Yes, so much to investigate. Let's get to it. Pathfinder, another deceased colonist. If you get me their name, I'll update the records and tag the body for recovery. Avante, Tegan C. Radiation got to her.
they sent the first colonists down here, everyone was so excited. After all the shit the Nexus had been through, we finally had something to believe in. Then the reports came back. This time will be different. Yeah, I'm more than ready to believe again. The person who left this behind, she was part of the first wave of colonists, wasn't she? The probability is high. This researcher may have left data pads at other remnant sites as well. about all this not many miners are out of stasis she acts like it's all right she's still optimistic but not stupid <laughs> not even a little bit you said damage to her cryo array woke her early how early she saw everything go down the uprising authority changing hands several times honestly Cora sometimes I wonder if she keeps it together so I don't give up activating automated forward station deployment there. The spot has shelter, water, stable ground. It was initially overlooked due to heavy kept presence at the nearby remnant structure, but it would be an excellent outpost site. Cut and remnant seems to Pathfinder, this location could support an outpost, but there are multiple complications to resolve. The first colonists sent audio logs about these regions back to the Nexus. And? Fairwinds Basin. Lowest radiation count in the area. Little bit of hope. We can work with that. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. The Site 1 folks were interested in the monoliths, too. Did they learn anything? Mostly what you learn the hard way. But hey, now you're here. <laughs> More remnant bots. These ones don't seem hostile.
high level of remnant encryption here, Pathfinder. To continue, you will need to decrypt it. What do we have here? I'll need to use the interface that controls this. That could come in handy. Should be enough glyphs. Interface failed, Pathfinder. Defense systems engaging. Interface accepted. That did... whatever that did. I see pathways lighting up all over. The monoliths are resonating. QEC contact? Well, whatever's happening, they're definitely connecting. You did good. Keep doing more. Can't drop shit. Seriously? It's a break. Shields are up. I'll take their... Trust me, or do cats seem to appear everywhere we find remnant tech? I was just thinking the same thing.
data on EOs back home? When everywhere was labeled H with a bunch of numbers? <laughs> Your dad put those readings up in his office. Knew them all by heart. Wonder what those worlds really looked like then. And now. Shuttle incoming. got the monolith well protected. We'll need to cut that shield's power supply.
Let's get to it before there's any more cat. Andromeda Initiative. We're not here to cause trouble. So you say. Still haven't told me who you are. Oh, come on, Drax. Stop that. Ventra, what are you doing here? I'm with the Pathfinder. That Pathfinder. A friend of Ventra's a friend of mine. My name's Sarah Ryder. I'm Drac, Clan Nackmore. You'll forgive me if I didn't just trust a stranger from the Nexus. They haven't exactly treated us Krogan well. What are you doing out here? Checking out these monoliths. The Kets seem pretty interested in this one. Looks like you cleared it out for us, though. You sad I didn't save any for you? Nexus knows shit about the Ket. They think they're safe, <laughs> but they're just waiting to die out there in space. I've been quads deep on a couple of planets for a while now, taking out Ked bases, fighting ground troops. <sighs> I know what they can do. It's not pretty. You know, Drac, we could use someone with your skills. Tempting as that is, Vetra, I'm a little too old to be carrying humans through a fight. Besides, the day I help the Nexus again is the day the clouds part and the Ket keel over. No offense. None taken. Good, because I'm getting bored and the Ket are getting stronger. Seem particularly interested in this alien tech. Remnant? Yeah, that. I'm gonna go find more to shoot. Try to keep your head out there. He seems fun. All Site 2 components are accounted for. Let's head to Site 2's research station and see what good they do. Anton, Darren T. Can't undo what happened, but we can make sure he's remembered. That we can, Pathfinder. A field log, Pathfinder, issued to patrolling Ket. I don't need a translation to know when I'm hearing a monster. Adding to language database.
should do it. Online and connected to something in the lake. This could be the master switch we're looking for. I'll meet you there. Don't do anything without me. So this technology on Habitat 7 was messing with the planet? We don't have all the answers yet. Don't expect any from the Nexus. They got a few reports, then the cat showed up. No time to study weird tech. Probably best to focus on the people shooting at you. an invitation. Hope it's safe. No. No, this can't be right. All that fanfare for an empty room? There's some secret here. There must be. Do your... Pathfinder thing. Oh, you're good. I didn't do a thing. That's a long way down. Can't tell how far. That can't be air pressure. Electrostatic? Ah, uh, gravitation. Oh, you idiot, PB. That wasn't the front door. This is. I'll let you know. Hey!
Acting like a gravity well. But where's it taking us? Embrace the unknown, Ryder. Now this is more like... Looks like a bunker. Or a vault. Whatever you call it. The controls for that atmosphere processor might be down here somewhere. Let's find out. Anything could be important. Let's be thorough. 